We have Fiona and I just priced vinyl records and they're awesome. They are so awesome. And on top of that, we've got a little unboxing of brand new because we're one week out until Christmas, just one week. So we're putting out as much stuff as we can because everybody's buying everything. So now I need you to give me some thumbs ups and some comments and subscribe and all that stuff and watch this video. Yeah. You know what I got to say to all that? What? You're just too demanding. Why? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Aliens even flow. Thumbs up. What are we doing now? We have a few tonight's Just Price Vinyl Records. And they're awesome. What? They're so awesome. They're amazingly awesome. Do you know why they're so awesome? Even flow. Exactly. What? Yeah. We got Pearl Jam 10. Is that an original? Yes. It is. It is from the 90s. You know something? What? I know somebody who has a fun fact. Yes. Did you know that song, Even Flow, you were just singing? It took like 10,000 takes and they still don't like it. They kept redoing it over and over and over again, trying to get it better how the way they wanted it. Yeah, no, they were just kind of like, eh, good enough. And they still didn't like it. <laughs> Let me tell you, this was an anthem for me in the 90s. Yeah. Me and every one of my friends. Okay. It was ridiculous. Whenever they would come out a new music video on MTV, mm -hmm. it was like, you know it was going to be an epic freaking day. Yeah. I mean, Eddie Vedder was freaking wild. Mm -hmm. Wild in those videos. Yeah. And then when Jeremy came out, it kind of hit home with everybody. Mm -hmm. Just because it was such a wild, insane music video mm -hmm. about children and school and yeah. not having a very good time. And with Jeremy, it was based off of two stories. It was based off of the kid Jeremy and it was based off of the singer's friend who ended up um, doing a mass shooting, unfortunately. Yeah, well, that's why I didn't want to go into any of that. Yeah. And I avoided <laughs> saying the words that I was going to really say, but wow. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Wow. All right. Even flow. And then we've got Pearl Jam. Oh, you know what that is? What? That's Drama Llama for your mama. Ah. Yeah, yeah. you didn't know that. Oh. But look at that. Nice. Mm -hmm. Gatefold from the 90s. Beautiful condition. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. These are all original? Yes, all original. Whoa. And Jeff almost quit the band. Why? Because his song Brother didn't go on the, on the album 10. He was very, very upset about this, and it was actually one of the worst fights they've ever had. Apparently, they've only ever had like two like massive fights, and mm. um, yeah, that song not going on the album really, really got him angry. Oh, yeah? You know what I have to say about that? What? If it was nowadays... Yeah. And he would have quit that band. You know what everybody would say about him? You're stupid. Dumbass! Yeah. Yeah. It was really bad, though. You, you look at these guys, and they look pretty laid back and like they're having fun together. Okay? So we've got a gatefold here. Hmm. And Interesting. And then we've got Vitalogy. And this is also an original from the 90s. And it's also a gatefold. But what's not a gatefold? The next one. Ten. Mm. Ten is not a gatefold with them looking all cool and relaxed and That's hanging true. out. So I wonder if that's why. Well, you know something? What? I'm going to say something and everybody's going to fight me down in the comments. Right. You ready? Yeah. Uh -huh. You ready? I'm about to get controversial. Okay. This is the last good album. Boom, I said it. I said it. It's the last oh, good man. album. It's going to be a fight. That's right. That's right. And they got 9,000 live show albums. I'm just saying. I told you. That this, that's it. Once this came out, you were like, whoo. Everybody's gonna be like, oh, Backspacer. Yep. Man, Backspacer got one good song. That's it. That's it? That's it. Just one? Fight me down in the comments. I'm not from back. <laughs> <laughs> Hit it. <laughs> the show they were inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame on April 7th, 2017. Hmm. Yes. Yeah, after only a few years of being eligible. I got a fun fact. Yes. That CD for Vitology does not fit on our shelves correctly. No. No. Why did they decide to do that? That was <laughs> awful. We all hate it. It's awful. Because it's Pearl Jam and they had to be different. Had, had to be different. Had to be different. <laughs> so we've got Pearl Jam, Daughter. All right. And this is a special edition 12-inch poster bag. Poster bag? Poster bag. Is it super mega ultra rare? It's not super mega ultra rare, but it having the poster is a lot rarer okay. than just the record. You hold it this and, way. And, and, Want to do something even better? What? It doesn't look like they actually hung it. I don't see no tape, no staples, none of that. It's because yeah, it was owned by a dude. Yeah, because if it was a girl, they still would have gotten licked. Licked? Licked. Whoa. Yep, she would have slurped them. Mmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> see, see your mother's mind, man? It goes right to the gutter. That's why I love her. No. <laughs> Soundgarden. Yes, right. we have Soundgarden, and this is another pressing from the 90s. I don't believe it's an original, though, because... 
It's blue. They did three colored pressings of this album. Okay. And they were all limited edition. This one just happens to be blue. But Soundgarden's really cool because they were the first grunge band to be signed to Sub Pop. Okay. And they were one of the first to be signed to a major label, and that was A&M Records. Hmm. Return to the back. Super unknown. Mm -hmm. Come on. Black Hole Sun. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. that's the one that uh that music video. You ever seen the music video for Black Hole Sun? I probably have. Everybody's melting and shit. Yeah. Wild. Yeah. And this was the album that made them famous. Of course. Of course. Fight her down in the comment. No. <laughs> <laughs> I think everyone's agreeing with that one. Yeah. No, yeah. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. REM Monster. Because it's the end of the world as we That's know it. One. Awesome. I don't know if it's on that one. I'm just singing the song. Uh, it's REM. It was, was in fact not on that one. <laughs> <laughs> it's not on that one. Fight me that night. <laughs> and then we've got Led Zeppelin, Physical Graffiti, Beautiful, Amazing Shape. Oh All right. my gosh. Led Zeppelin. And then we've got Led Zeppelin Untitled, and it really is untitled. Man, you say untitled. You know what happens? They really do fight you down in the comments. It is not. He's still carrying the it sticks. It is seriously. Okay, well, do you know why he's carrying the sticks? <laughs> why? He is carrying the sticks because the cover of this album is based on a tarot card. Ooh. Of the Hermit. Okay. Yeah. So Aliens. Okay. Yeah. But Voodoo magic. Witch really, and woman. Oh, oh. It really is untitled. They had it as untitled. Not as four, not as Zoso. They're just symbols. They don't mean anything. Yes, they do. They don't. They do. They don't. They do. Not to Led Zeppelin. Fight me down on the cover. <laughs> 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 just saying. Man, why, why you got to ruin everybody's good time? That's Led Zeppelin 4. It is, no, it it I, is four. untitled. I it's dub four. the untitled. I dub the Led Zeppelin 4. It is untitled. They were done with titles. It was untitled. They were fucking lazy. <laughs> <laughs> I just call Zeppelin lazy, right? Okay, so we David got Bowie. David Bowie changes, and this one. At least he named his record. Is clear. Nice. From 1990. All right, all right. Good Bowie. Let's mm. dance. David Bowie. Queen, the miracle. What's on that one? There's got to be a song on there or two that I know. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna have to play it. I think I know the miracle. Mm. I'm sure. I'm sure I know it, yeah. but I just. But this one came out in 1989. Okay. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Queen. We all know what's on that one. Queen. And more queen. And that one. Queen. And that one. Yeah. Flesh. Yeah. Ah, Savior of the universe. Do, do. Oh. Just saying. Queen. Hot sauce. Hot space. Close enough. I really like that too. It's okay. And then we've got the Rippingtons. Curves ahead. This is jazz rock. Jazz rock. Mm -hmm. The Rippingtons. Mm -hmm. What's the back end look like? Oh, look at that. Mm -hmm. Looks like Michael Bolton. No, it's Russ Freeman. Mm, I was close. Okay. Jimi Hendrix. Radio One. But wait. It's clear. Whoa. Oh, yes. Whoa. All right. Go you. Mm -hmm. yeah. Clear Jimmy's. And this one's also from 1990. Jimi Hendrix. And we've got another Jimi Hendrix. This is a 1986 reissue, so it has the barcode. Ah, that's how you could tell. And it's in beautiful shape. You know how you can tell the difference between an old record and a new record? Hold that one up, please. Yeah. You know, you know it was produced after 1977 mm -hmm. because of that barcode. So anything before 1977 will not have that barcode. Because barcodes weren't around like that. Hmm. that. That goes for books, CDs. Well, CDs weren't even around like that. But 8-tracks, anything that doesn't have a barcode, pretty much, was made before 1977. I guess right in my head. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> when did cassette tapes start being made? Well, if it was before, they were they were before 77. Okay, because I was going to say, there's a bunch of them the, that don't have barcodes. There are them. cassettes that don't have barcodes. It, okay, and if it doesn't have a bar, if it doesn't have a barcode and it's like 1980s, uh -huh. 90s, the clubs. Okay. That's another, that's another surefire way. But if you know an album's supposed to be old and it doesn't have a barcode at all, mm -hmm. chances are it's an older than 1977. Cool. Even books. Journeys, greatest hits. But with books that have ISBNs. Different story. Journey raised on radio. 
And then we got Living Color, Vivid. They got one good song. Fight me in the comments. <laughs> okay, well, what about this one? I don't know that one. No, you don't know this one? You don't know this Living Color? Oh, wow, look at her. It's yellow. You won. <laughs> fight the fight. Mm. Fight the fight. Okay, some funk metal. And there's two, so you can go. <laughs> wicky, wicky, woo. And they're both yellow. It's, it's hard rock, right? It's funk metal. Okay, that's, that's what I thought it was. Mm -hmm. but... B-52s. I don't know them. Keith <laughs> <laughs> Lorraine. Rock, rock, rock. Oh, um, that's so much fun on, on the um, Wii. I think I think it's on Just Dance 4, but it might be on Just Dance 2014. I don't remember which. Mm. But yes, it's a lot of fun. There's a lot of Rock up song! You're over there. So much fun doing that. <laughs> we got another B-52s, Rome. The Love Shack. Oh, and then we got this B-52s. That thing's what? freaking cool. Mm-hmm. Oh. Rock Lobster and Planet Claire. Very, very cool. Mm-hmm. Very cool. Surrealistic Pillow, Jefferson Airplane, it's and right. it's an original. Is it? It is. Is it Beat the Hell? It's Normally not beat they the are. Hell. That's beat to hell. You ate the corner? I did not. Mm. I don't recommend. She licked it. Oh, man. It's true with those two. <laughs> yes. What? The dog on top. Yeah. With all, with all the RCA victors. Oh, side two. What about side one? Oh, sorry. Aww. Somebody put their initials. This is how I know the difference between my blue Hawaii's. Ah. <laughs> their initials were that. JS. Mm -hmm. Jack shit. Oh. Aliens. Do -do -do -do. Boom! Pink Floyd. Wish you were here. We got another Pink Floyd. Okay. The Beatles. Super duper clean. Super duper. Super duper clean. Nice. This one has the Rainbow Capital label. And this Beatles is super duper clean. It's got the Purple Capital label. That's right. The Beatles. And it is an import from the UK. 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 Okay. Allman Brothers Band. Oh, you know what that thing has in there? What? It, it's, it's got some sort of insert. I forget what kind. I forget where I put it now. It's super clean, though. Yeah, it's not every day you see the insert sheet on Eat a Peach. Aliens. Very cool. Very exciting. Yes, yeah, very. You, you don't see that too no, often. No, you don't. A lot very of these exciting. things got posters in them. Like, uh, I don't know. You'll get to them. <laughs> Tom Payton Heartbreakers. Don't come around here no more. What? Here's a little ditty. No. <laughs> and this one's an import from the UK. Nice. Jim Morrison. And that has the book in it. Super clean. Yes. You know how it goes. The Doors. Not an original, but still awesome. The Doors. The Doors. Alive, she cries. They were alive. They were alive. Yeah. The Cure. What Never cure? enough. The Cure to everything. What? The Cure is the cure to everything. Mmm. Probably nobody commented on my comment yesterday. I know. Scorpions. Oh. And guess what? They were what? What? live, 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 live. Around the freaking world. Yeah. They were, they were alive, they were alive. <laughs> the Eagles. Oh, yeah? You know yeah. what that one has? The poster. It has the freaking poster. Your favorite bathroom? Yes. You, you might want to... No, no, not that one. Keep it going. The Eagles. And they were alive, they were alive. I wasn't ready. Okay. I think it's in that one. The Eagles. No, no, you got to open that one up. No, not that one. Yeah. There's so many posters. I'm telling you. No, no. There might be a poster in there, I think. I could be wrong. Shoot, if I am, I'm wasting everybody's time. I'm sorry. Oh, no, I see it, I see it. Oh, my God. <laughs> your so homeboy's crazy. on it. You're like, no, no, no. It's Timothy. I told Timothy you, your right homeboy. Yeah. Look how good he looks. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he could be in a metal band. He does. He got it's that hair, fun. doesn't he? He does. He has the hair. Mm. Oh, great. I'm like, I'm going to lick him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to lick him. <laughs> wow. I can't lick him. We have to sell the poster. I can't lick him. Mmm. Wow, temptation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Aliens. The Eagles. Bobby Jameson. Sound the graphic. They're alive. They're alive. Now, you know something. What? That one, too, also has something for it. I don't know what, though. Uh, wasn't this one a booklet? I think, I think so. It's in there. Oh, cool. That's right. Sorry, I don't see anyone I want to lick. What? Nope. It's not Timothy. Uh, there's a lot of dudes, man. You're going to get busy licking. Nope. Man, you're going to be there a while. I don't see anybody. Imagine your mother in Central Park licking people. <laughs> I'm, I'm good. <laughs> See, it's just <laughs> randomly doing the time warp. <laughs> yes. Yes. It's just a double oh, for a quick check. Mmm. Two steps to the right. Sign the Garfunkel. 
Elton John, Goodbye Elbrook Road. Elton John. And they were live, they, they were live, live in Australia. Mm-hmm. Mia Cherry. Quiet Riot. Nice. Yeah. The Critters, Younger Girl. Now, this one is Garage Rock from the late 60s. Mm -hmm. And if it was in better shape, it would be very rare and worth a lot of money. But okay. it's not. The record's not bad. All this talk about licking and then you bit the corner. I did not. Man. I did not. And we got Renaissance, which is fabulous because there are none in the section. Really? Mm hmm Okay. Nectar. Yay, I love Nectar. Suzanne Vega. The Cars. Huey Lewis in the News. Sports. Genesis. Another Genesis. Oh, I like that color variation. That one's my favorite. It's different, right? The Who. Who? Robin Trower. What's next? Debbie Harry. Oh, who, man, who, I, got, I got Debbie Harry fun fact. Yeah, what's that? Did you know that Debbie Harry grew up in Hawthorne, New Jersey? No, no, no. Yeah. Uh, wait, did you know that Debbie Harry went to Centenary College in Hackettstown, New Jersey? That's right. Wow. Uh -huh. And graduated from there. With an associate's degree. Boom. <laughs> but I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. Jersey. 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 That's right. Jersey. Debbie freaking Harry, man. Mm -hmm. And she still has a house in Monmouth County somewhere. Mm -hmm. Cool. That's right. That's very cool. She's 75 years old. I don't think we'd recognize her if she came into our store ever. Uh-uh. I'm not. I'm just saying. She, she could have been in. She could have. Mm. We, we got a lot of crazy old ladies. Yes. Tons. You can't call Debbie Harry old. It doesn't matter if she's 75. I'm not calling her old. Okay. I'd still lick her. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Culture Club. Club. <laughs> Would you like him, though? Of course, it's Boy George. Boy what else do you do with Boy George? <laughs> <laughs> Blood Rock, and guess what? They're, they're alive, they're alive! alive. Mm. Henry Gross. Would you lick him? His last name is Gross. Hey, I had an awesome substitute. His, uh, he, he was Mr. Gross. He was awesome. He ended up becoming a professor at Rucker. Mm. But, yes. I had a teacher, awesome. Mr. Grow. Back at Clifton High School, told me I should drop the hell out. Mm -hmm. So if you know Mr. Grow, taught <laughs> back in the ass. 90s, kick him in the ass. Tell him, look, I became something. I don't know what, but something. Jefferson <laughs> Starship, the Souther Hillman Furry Band. Oh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, what? wait a minute. What? I forgot Debbie Harry fun fact. What was that? Did you know, I, it was either her or Stevie Nicks, but I think it was her. <laughs> Oh, no, maybe. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. We're going to keep it going, man. Anyway. Oh, my God. It's the Beastie Boys. I can still wrap this whole album. I tested it in the car with my sister. No sleep till. Donna. Brooklyn. Do <laughs> you ever meet somebody from Brooklyn? Yes. Yes. You're guaranteed to meet somebody from Brooklyn. Yes. Always. You're going to know they're from Brooklyn because they're going to tell you they're from Brooklyn. They always yeah, do. Yeah, within the first five seconds. I'm from Brooklyn. I'm from Brooklyn. Uh -huh. It's guaranteed. Yes. Uh -huh. I ain't knocking them. I, yeah. I get it. You it's know, always. I mean, it's like a badge of honor or something. Mm -hmm. You know. I need this. No. You have I one. That one. You have that one. I need that one's you super clean. One. Yours is effed up. That's the store khaki. I need it. No. No. <laughs> no. You owe me 96 reviews. Nick I tried called Quest. Nice. <laughs> Ziggy Marley, Enya. Someone better come in here and buy that sucker before she hides Oh, wait. It, it wasn't 96. It's 95. Because I did review. <laughs> Casey no, with the Sunshine Band. <laughs> Enigma, Sadness, Part 1. It's mm. trance music. And then we've got the songs of Leonard Cohen. Nice yeah, little folk. folk to end this sucker. Yes. Man, you know we're on like 18 minutes already, so I ain't even going to bother with a poll on this one. Uh -huh. We're going to jump over and do right to this unboxing in three seconds. Hey, Rihanna. Yes. I got a very important question. What's your very important question? What is your spirit animal? Do -do -do -do. Aliens. A giraffe. A giraffe? A giraffe. Oh, okay. I thought it was a penguin. I, I do love penguins. Are you sure? Yes. I don't think you love penguins. I do. They're my favorite animal. Did you know that Fleetwood Mac had an album called Penguin? I thought that was a cover album. I don't, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We, we better investigate. Oh, huh. I haven't seen this. Huh. No, I haven't seen this one actually. Ha ha. I had no idea this was a thing. Thought it was your spirit animal. Since it's not, I'm gonna sell it. No. Yes. I this. No. But 
it's pe it's it's called penguin. I kind of need it now. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> he looks like an angry penguin, doesn't he? He really does. This is about to go get get something. I'm just saying, you know, you yeah. don't need it no more. Yes, I do. <laughs> I thought it was your spirit animal. If I ever find a red panda on on an album, I'm so gonna give it to Katie. Oh yeah. <laughs> so you know, I mean, penguin, you. Close enough. You're wearing black with Santa's. What? What? Penguin. <laughs> Penguins. <laughs> Get him, buddy. Oh, man. Wow. One just crawled across his tail. Oh, that's a dead duck right there. Oh, man. Did you see that one? No, I didn't. Aliens. He's just tearing them apart. What you doing? Wrapping up SpoonRoundStore.com orders. What? SpoonRoundStore.com. Is that Holy Diver? No. Let's dive her down. down. Oh, see, I was close. Where's it going? Who's it going to? It is going to Timothy in Maynard, Massachusetts. Nice. Thank you, Timothy. Mm-hmm. We sold lots of Spooning Around Stores t-shirts. Yep. Aliens. Doo -doo -doo -doo. No, not aliens. Black ones. What? Black aliens? No. Black or the greys. Are you talking about the greys? Oh, man. Don't make me get into the alien conspiracies. Black t-shirts. Oh, okay. Okay. I don't know. The greys? You don't know about the greys? No, I don't know about the greys. All right, check this out. When you meditate too hard, uh -huh. they show up. Okay. Yeah. And? They know everything. Ah. Mm, they know where I store my booger collection and all. I know where you store your booger collection. What? Yeah. Shh. Don't tell anyone. We're gonna kick that one out of the way. Ha! Huh. What are we doing? Unboxing! Hit it! And we're unboxing! We got four little boxes here, but those boxes seem little. They're not so freaking little. Man, we got some Kid Cudi. That's Stop right. It. Just working with some pops. Yeah, pops. There's only like three in here. Oh, man, you got stuck with the pops. I got stucked with the pops. Man. Yeah, these. This is that new distributor stuff right uh -huh. there. So we got, got the same four one. Kid Cuddies. Who is it? Uh, from Dragon Ball Z. Nice, you got six of them? Yes. Very cool, oh, just move them to the side then, because yeah. pops are pops. I got more Kid Cuddy. All right, all right. I ordered a lot of Kid Cuddy, because we've been selling a lot of Kid Cuddy. We have, we definitely have. Well, they kind of packed us. And a lot of these things are running out. Yes. Through the distributors, because it is Christmas time. You got one week. Yeah. So if you want something, you better come in here. You want some Kid Cuddy? First thing. Here you go. It might not always be in the section. Thanks people hide them. Yes. Oh yeah. <laughs> I bet you your song's on there too. I bet it is. <sighs> some Pink Floyd, some doors coming out of here. Some kiss. Alright. Stevie Nicks? No slave town. Donna. Brooklyn. <laughs> Grass monkey. That Grass funky monkey. monkey. Is there anything in this? Or did they just I put a perfect picture? Yeah, they just put it for protection. Do, 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 do. Aliens. All right, all right. We oh, are getting okay. this done really quickly. I see a rare one now. <laughs> ah, good old Tay Tay. Nice. We needed some Tay Tay. Yes. People have been coming in here. Yes. Come asking for the Tay Tay. Right. Oh. Which a woman? See how high she flies. Nice, nice. Where the hell my phone? Oh, there's that thing. I was just asking you about that yes, thing. Yes, you were. Very cool. Lee Gaga. It might not look like it, but it is in fact Lee Gaga. Interesting. Who is Lindy that? Spears? Whoa. Is that the indie exclusive, Lindy? Whoa. Yeah, I think. Yeah, Lindy edition. One of them's mine. If there's only one, suckers, it's mine. There's only one right now. And we have one. Don't come running in for it because you ain't getting it from me over my dead. I don't know. Oh. Don't kill me, guys, man. <laughs> she gave me chocolate ice cream right before this video. I kid you not. Yes. It was a small. It shouldn't have hurt anything. A am I it wrong? It was super duper chocolatey, too. I got my own campfire. It was ridiculously chocolatey. Yes, it was, it was so like, good. Oh, holy crap. Yeah, chocolate. they just refilled the machine. Yeah, it was excellent. It was awesome. All right, we can go through these in like three seconds. Yep. Go ahead, Rihanna. Hit it. We have the wall. All right. We don't need no, no education. education. That's how I really feel. Neil Young, Britney Spears, Lady Gaga. <sighs> Uh, Post Malone, Dua Lipa. Elizabeth. You knew how to say that. Yeah, I had a discussion about this with someone today. Nice. <laughs> uh, Nirvana, Taylor Swift, there's three, so you go wiki 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 woo woo. Woo 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 woo. Green Day. <laughs> I miss my dog. <laughs> uh, Stevie Nicks, 
Bitch, I want the Doors, Pink Floyd, uh, Tribe Called Quest. Boom! Oh, what you working yeah. with? I got the Beatles Rubber Soul. What? Two of those. Notorious B.I.G., Mac Miller Swimming, yeah. Billie Eilish, got a couple of her. Fleetwood Mac, Billie Eilish, King Gizzard, Rumors. I took the last of the Rumors, B, guys. More Rumors. Beastie Boys, Adele, Kiss, Queen, Beastie Boys, Wu Tang. Then we got a whole bunch of Kid Cuddies. And in the middle of that, there is Foxborough Hot Tubs. And then we got some more Kid Cuddies. Now, listen, yes. here's what happened, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Those Fleetwood Macs are all those. Uh, uh, they're pressed at Palace. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. They're all the good pressings. Mm -hmm. They had 11 left. I said, ah, screw it. And I just bought them all. I don't know how many they ended up getting to me, but. They're not supposed to be in for a little while now. Yeah. So they are going to run out and they're going to reissue it from mm -hmm. somewhere else and you're not going to have those pressings anymore. Right. And I heard they're the best pressings in the whole entire world. Exactly. So, so now we needed them. I need a freaking pole. Okay. You got two seconds. One Mississippi. This stuff, that stuff. Two Mississippi. You better go right here. You see how far down this is? It looks like we only got one of those Britney Spears, man. I'm taking it. I'm sorry, guys. I got no Britney in my collection, and I love to scream Britney, bitch, all day long. Yes. So I'm just saying, what you working with? Beastie Boys. All right, all right. What's on this one? Flip it. All the great stuff. I need this. So, oh, buy a movie. Check it check yours. Uh, uh, that's not too... Uh. Eh, you know, if, if I had Intergalactic Sabotage. on there... If Intergalactic was on there, I would take that. Yeah, Intergalactic Sabotage is one of the best songs. Awesome, I, love, I love that song. Sabotage. What you working with? Lizzo. Put it on my phone. No, because I love you. All right, all right. Oh, Fiddler did a cover of Sabotage. It's actually pretty good. I'm going to have to check that out. Yes. All right, bottom of the screen. Let me know who won this down in the comments. Is it Lizzo or is it Beastie Boys? You got to fight for your right, right to, to party. party. You're not too happy about this, huh? <laughs> you know who I pick, right? Boom. I know. Always. It's hip hop against each other, though. Even though I like you more. What? Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. How I hate when I forget to unplug yeah, it's you. To do. Right? <sighs> wow. She just ripped you apart, dude. She took all your power. And it's done. <laughs> What's your shirt say? Uh, I, oh, I just went to this. It's the Lehigh Valley Zoo Winter Light Spectacular. Oh, yeah. That thing was a lot of fun. Gotta say. Did you like it? Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Um, a lot of people were wearing their masks, but besides that, it was fine. Um, the heroes are pretty good, too. They had heroes all over the park. And I got to meet my favorite Disney princess, which is Belle. I'm very happy. I was really? Crying. And she was my height. She was 5'9", I'm 5'10", so I was slightly taller. One of the best moments. Did you kick her butt? I, I almost Did you jack her for her crown? Uh, that was the wrong door to open. About why tall, being tall is awesome. Oh, okay. Okay. What are they going to do now? So now they gotta leave a comment and let us know what their favorite record in those boxes was because it's some really awesome stuff. They gotta give us a like, a big old thumbs up because everyone likes a thumbs up because when you do good, you get good. And then they have to subscribe, 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 subscribe. Ring, ring that bell, bell. ding, 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 because we do a video like this a lot. And we'll see you soon. And now they're gonna go to spinaroundstore.com and buy some stuff. Yes, exactly. Like the new t shirt. Yes. <laughs> all right, all right, interesting. <laughs> it ain't whipping my Wednesday, I kick your ass.